All right, so basically what you want to do is you want to take out your hammer or your club if you haven't gotten the hammer yet. But at, if, you, if you don't have the hammer at this point in the game, just go back and do more stuff and get the chalices because you're doing something wrong. Okay, so basically whatever platform you hit, rocks will fall in the platform behind it. And you want to try and make rocks land on his head. So he's over there now, so I can't really get to him. Kill me. Yeah. Take this dragon potion and leave me alone. Drink it when you need it. It gives you armor that is impervious to heat. Brush it makes you breathe fire. All right. Thank you. Okay. So, we got the dragon armor potion, which, I don't know, it sort of looks like an organ. I guess it's supposed to be a bottle. But basically, we have like the head of a dragon and the armor of a dragon and we can breathe fire! It's pretty handy. When you equip it, your shield comes off, but you can put the shield back on. Okay, but for now I'm going to equip my broadsword, magic one. Okay, so, that was an optional boss, and that's why you want to get the two dragon gems. And it, all it really gives you is the, uh, the dragon armor, but it's, it's handy. Another bat, really? So you want to cross this gorge cavern thing. Ow. There's a few more enemies over here, they're nothing. There should be like one more enemy. Oh wait, I know, they're at the exit. So, we're gonna go down here. And, whoops. Come on. Over here is where I said the exit was. Put the star rune in there. Okay, cool, he almost got my, almost got my sword. Let me kill those guys. Okay, the chalice can now be collected. Lovely, wonderful. Let's go grab it. It's right back here. Just be careful not to fall. Yay! It better be awaiting us. Alrighty. Oh, 
Oh, wait. Before I go, I'm gonna get some health. I'd like to leave with full health. Yay, Hall of Heroes! What's he got to say now? Wouldn't this make a wonderful tourist attraction? Come see Stangard the Mighty! Come and see the last of the centaurs! Oh, and see that dog over there? That's Daniel Fortescue, would-be hero! Ha 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 ha! Screw you! I swear, this game isn't... E I don't even think this game is about, like, saving the day or anything. It's just about making them stop calling me names. Okay, so... There's this big door that's at the end of the Hall of Heroes. And, uh, it was locked throughout, like, the whole game up till now. So, let's see. Oopsie. Hang on. Daniel there you are. I was so worried about you. Yep. You were? I know you have the heart of a hero, Daniel. Now we must show the others. Would you like to take my magic lightning bolts? I don't have many, but they're very powerful. <laughs> Off you pop then, and Off keep you your pop. chin up. <laughs> Oops, sorry Daniel. <laughs> now take care. The good people of Galamir are depending on you. Yes, that looks like a deadly weapon. Yeah, the lightning is, uh, it's sort of a, you can only use it once, so, I, I don't really use it, but, because I don't really think it's that powerful, actually. Um, and like I said, there is a limited supply of it, so. But you can try to use it if you want, test it out, see if you like it. Epic pose. Oh, what's the next place we go to? Oh, I think I know, and it's awful. Uh, I do not like this level. The gallows gauntlet. It's just. It's such a short, short level. Uh, but hey, it's a chalice, so we gotta do it. 